Hello and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Lozello, Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas. Nevada. The radial collateral ligament is often abbreviated to RCL. It is also known as the lateral collateral ligament of the elbow. The radial collateral ligament provides stability to the elbow during varus motions and posterior lateral rotation. The radial collateral ligament is often abbreviated to the RCL. It is also known as the lateral collateral ligament of the elbow. It provides stability to the elbow joint during varus stresses and posterior lateral rotation. It has three parts, the annular ligament, the lateral radial collateral ligament, and the lateral ulnar collateral ligament. The lateral ulnar collateral ligament originates from the lateral epicondyle of the humerus and it sorts at the supinator crest of the ulna. It is the predominant stabilizer during posterior lateral rotation. The annular ligament stabilizes the proximal radial ulnar joint. It originates in, and inserts at the sigmoid notch of the ulna as it wraps around the neck of the radius. The lateral radial collateral ligament originates at the inferior surface of the lateral epicondyle and attaches to the annular ligament. The radial collateral ligament is also known as the lateral collateral ligament of the elbow. It has three parts, the annular ligament, the lateral radial collateral ligament, and the lateral ulnar collateral ligament. It provides stability to the elbow joint during various stresses and posterior lateral rotation. 